What is going on YouTube? Sam here from Pocket Studios welcoming you back to a Pokemon Colosseum randomized Nuzlocke. This is episode 11 and I spy a couple of items up there. I guess we'll go and get those later. I don't know why we can't jump that gap. Wes has such long legs. I never noticed and you still can't jump it. Anyways, in today's episode, I'm really hoping that we can get to Mirror B. Last episode, we've basically just been stuck in this cave for like two episodes now. And I'm kind of fed up with it, so today we're going to be trying to get out of here. The last episode, we caught ourselves a little snake called Surviper. I'm going to deposit Cedra, and as much as I would love to put Wormple on the team, it's not worth getting rid of Swampert or Welmer for. And I don't know if you thought that was sarcastic, but honestly it's not. I really want Wormple, because I really, really want a Dustox. But anyways, I think we've just got... We're just going to bypass you. Okay, bye. Um, <laughs> I think we just got more battles to do today, which kind of sucks because it's all we've been doing the last couple of episodes. Um, honestly, it's pretty much all you do in this game, actually, but we're going to... Oh my gosh, we're bypassing everyone. It's amazing. So, I really... This cave just kind of sucks. If you've been watching the series, you know I don't really like it too much, and I really wanted to just grind it out, but I can't because I don't know who I shadow Pokemon. Wait, where are we right now? What? Where is this? this? You can't go this way. I think left is where the items were. Uh, we'll go get them later, I guess. There's a lady here. Is Mirror B just right up there? I think he is. Oh my gosh. How do we get here so fast? Are you looking for Duking's Pokemon? Could it be beyond here, I wonder? That was kind of like a guy's voice for a woman. Oh well. Chase Amila doesn't matter. <laughs> Her name is an anagram of Meal. That's a new one. Okay. She's got a Feebas and a Tentacruel. Um, if we've got Aggron and Whelmer, that's just annoying, so I need to switch out. I think I'll put Surviper in though, see what Surviper can do. See see how good its Shadow Rush is, because uh, that's all it's going to have. No Shadow Pokemon here. Okay, the battlefield is all red and messing up. So, I got a couple of things. Oh, I've actually got a lot to talk I always have so much to talk about, and then never, never managed to get around to it. But, right now I'm recording in OBS everything. So if anything, if anything messes up, I'm completely screwed. But normally I record my audacity, audio separately in Audacity. Um, and I just, I don't know, it's really annoying trying to sync it up every time. Edit it and then render it and then edit it and just like... It's such a faff. And I finally got around to learning how to use OBS properly. So right now, the game audio, my audio, my face cam, and the gameplay, and most of the layout apart from the Pokemon is all recording at the same time. So if any of it breaks, I am entirely screwed because I have like zero backup or anything. But it makes my life like a hundred times easier when I'm making this. So I can literally just sit down and record and be like, cool, done, upload, rather than being like, okay, let's try audio sync this. And it's just annoying. It's like infinitely better than how I used to do it. So. If you're a YouTuber, I would entirely advise, well, provided this is working, I've done a couple of tests, hopefully, let me know in the comments, are the audio levels okay? Uh, hopefully the game audio isn't completely drowning me out right now. We just got a critical hit, that's awesome. Um, what else did I want to talk about? Uh, this series is just going great, it's daily so far still. I, I was so far ahead with this series and I got a bit lazy. Um, and I'm recording this the same day it's going up, which is a little bit bad. Oh, Survivor's in hyper mode now as well, that's cool. Uh, and I, yeah, I've just been ahead with this for the longest time, and then now I'm like, oh god, it's Sunday and I haven't got a call the same episode. <laughs> so, I don't know, I'm just, just catching up. I've just been busy the last couple of days, I guess, and doing a lot of Pokemon Fusion stuff. I'm having so much fun doing that series now and making it so much better. The way I used to do it before was so dumb. I just... They would look so stupid, but it was kind of funny, I guess. Uh, but now I'm actually trying to make an, a little bit of an effort and put a bit more effort into them. And they look a lot smarter and nicer because of it, so I'm very happy with that. I've also been working on a little... It's not really an animation project, it's kind of like... A little anime... not tutorial either. It's like my response to a tutorial video, basically. Meal says, <laughs> don't you people have any sense of direction? I bet you're having trouble getting around this cave. Uh, I'm pretty sure we're not. Oh, you're a lady here. Okay, we're not where I thought we were. Damn it, that's annoying. Okay. I guess we'll bow her. 
Hey, she, oh, she does want to bow. There's a little notification. Exclamation. It's definitely not a notification. Okay, let's shut up. <laughs> oh, now isn't this something? This is the edge of the world. Good of you to come. Awesome. I feel like she's going to have a shadow Pokemon. She's dressed up like a loony. What a weird outfit. She looks like Daphne from Scooby-Doo. Bulbasaur and Flaffy. Oh, Flaffy would be so cool. So Bulbasaur. Either of these shadow. Yes, please. That would be very nice. I feel like we don't need so much coverage now, though. Really? You don't have a shadow Pokemon? Okay, well, Wilma needs to switch out. Agron can destroy Bulbasaur. Guys, I finally googled what Agron is weak to. It is four times weak to fighting and four times weak to ground. Why is our team so hyper right now? I'm going to send Dunsparce in. So, I had no idea it was four times weak to ground, so I'm very glad I checked that so we can watch out for that now. And, yeah, I think I think that's everything. Like, last episode, we've just been, just been caving. This episode, we're still caving, and now we're, like, in the sewers or something. And we're trying to find Mirror B still. His damn awesome Pokeball hair. I never noticed that his hair was a Pokeball when I was younger. And it's just a massive Afro Pokeball. It's really awesome. <laughs> but anyways, hopefully we find him today. Um, if we don't, it's just going to suck so bad. So... I don't know. I don't know where he is, so I can't really do anything about it. And I don't know who's got Shadow Pokemon, so I literally have to just fight everyone. Um, let's let's just kill Swablu. So the Nintendo Direct happened. <laughs> it wasn't actually playing while I was recording. Um, I thought it was, but I was wrong. So I watched it anyway. I watched it live on PD Winnell's stream, and. It was, it was cool, I think. The question of the day today, by the way, is going to be, what do you guys think of the Direct? I know it's super late. Like, the Direct was two days ago now, or whatever. But, um, I thought it was decent. I was really happy with, like, I didn't, I didn't see anything and think, oh god, what is that? That really sucks. I was just a bit sad there wasn't more stuff. But, like, obviously, everyone's always going to be sad that there's no more stuff. Because it's Nintendo, and everyone loves Nintendo stuff, right? Um, so... Like, it's, it's always going to end and you're going to be like, oh, but what if this has this been shown? But I think a lot of people were sad that there was no Smash Bros. A lot of people, a, lo a lot of people were sad, at least on my Twitter, that there was no Animal Crossing. Um, and both of those games, I'm just like, it's whatever. I'm not particularly bothered there was no Animal Crossing or Smash, because I'm not really into those games so much. Um... Pokken Tournament on the Switch, I just, I want a Switch just for that game, it looks so cool. Um, and what else, what else, that was a really cool, like, two, I think it was called a two, they called it a 2D HD game. And it just looks so pretty, I really want to try and replicate that style, and just do a little art piece or something with it. Because it was so awesome, I loved it so much, and I can't remember what the game was called, I think it was a oh, JRPG or something though. If you guys saw the Direct, you probably know what I'm talking about. It was exclusive for the Switch, made by Square Enix, I think. It just looks so cool. So, how did she not have a Shadow Pokémon? There was like Xenoblade stuff, I think, which I'm not that interested in. Uh, what a wasted effort for you, there's nothing here for you. Why you are all busy wasting time, what became of that Pokémon you're after? Ho ho ho. Is this not the right way? No! Are you kidding me? I just ran all the way over here. What is up with that bit of wall there? Okay. Well, that was a fun little detour. Guess we're going all the way back. Unless it's this way. I feel like we're just going to do so many battles and not get to Mirabi. Which is going to really suck for you guys. And I definitely apologize. What is even over here? It's such a... Hey, it's a lady. There's such a long pathway. I think the items are probably over here. I'm in training here. One day I'm going to win at the Coliseum. Oh, I don't think you are. I think I'm just going to beat you and kill all your Pokemon and you're going to be stuck here forever. That's really dark. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Hunter Melly. So this is just, this is just me meal, but with an eye instead. Anyway, what was I talking about? The Direct. Yeah, so we saw Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon stuff. Two new Ultra Beasts, which I was like, whoa. It's pretty weird. Why does no one have Shadow Pokemon down here? It's dumb. I could have been grinding. Um... Well, Wilma's got to switch out again. Wilma is useless right now. Actually, both of my Pokemon have to switch out. Everything is so hype. <laughs> it's crazy. Well, Swampert could come in. 
damn, it's got magnet pool. Okay. Swampert can come in for Whelmer then. Agron can try and destroy the Soaking in one hit. Kinda needs to. And Ooh, I don't know. This well, Swampert is gonna be immune to Magneton, right? If it goes for electric. So part ground type. And that's going for Agron then, I guess. Oh, okay. Don't touch me, Slow King. Thank you. Kind of scared right now. I need to use a Hyper Potion. I did way more damage than I thought it would do. We get the crit on Slow King, though. That's nice. That's super nice. Okay. Okay, what do I want to do? Definitely heal up Agron. And then I think... We got four Hyper Potions. When did we buy those or did we find them? Okay, anyways. That's on full health. Swampert is going for the Shadow Rush. It's gonna kill... It's gotta kill Slow King. Sonic Boom, that's fine. That's only 20 damage, I think. Yep. We can live that. We can live another... S Wait, Slow King... If Slow King goes for a Water-type move... I don't think it's gonna... Because Swampert is gonna knock it out. It doesn't! Swampert, you're useless! How did you not get a crit? Agron wasn't even in hyper mode and it critted. Thank you, you went for Growl. Ooh. This is intense, because I can't switch out. And I really want to. Okay. Shadow Rush Magneton. And Shadow Rush Slow King. Supersonic! Oh, thank god you missed. That was lucky. Swampert, you better kill this time. Finally! That took way too long. Okay, Slow King's out of the way now, so I don't need to worry about Agron so much. Ooh, Spark did a lot though, didn't it? I wasn't expecting that. Anyways, <laughs> back to the Nintendo Direct. Where was I? Ultra Sun, Ultra Moon. We saw some Ultra Beasts. That was pretty much it um, for Pokemon, which I was a little bit surprised about. I don't know what I was expecting, really. Just, I don't know, a little bit more. But it also is nice that they're not going to show off the entire game, because they've done that a lot lately. They've shown off a considerable amount of the game, almost all of it, in fact, before, like, releasing it. And it's just like, well, why am I going to buy the game? I know exactly what's going to happen, don't you? No, I don't know. Like, I like... Swampert is powerful, yes. I like to play a game and be, like, mildly surprised at what comes up. Um... And, I don't know, I don't think people were so much in Sun and Moon, but I don't know. Uh, what else about the Direct? We saw a bit of Metroid stuff. I really, really want that Metroid game. I can't really afford it right now, which sucks. Um, but I really want it. It looks so good. And I was kind of sad that we didn't see any Metroid Prime 4 stuff. I would have really have liked to have seen some of that stuff. I, I, I'm hyped for Prime 4, <laughs> even though all we've seen so far is, like, the title kind of zoom out. And it's just like... It's pretty much it, but I'm I'm excited for it. Anyway, I'm excited to take on Mirror B if he's this way. I'm so lost. I'm actually lost in this cave. I really hope we get to Mirror B. I'm so sorry if we don't. Okay, maybe. Is it this place that's bad for my training? Definitely. Who would train in a sewer? Hey, we found the items. Awesome. Da -da 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 -da. One protein. Oh no, is this just going to be like all those weird stat boosting things? It is! I don't want these, I want like potions and uh, ultra balls, I was going to say hyper balls then. Hyper balls would be awesome. Actually, guys, this is a fun fact. Fun, this is like fun fact 3, isn't it? I've had fun fact 2 with Gorbis and fun fact 1 with Furret. Fun fact 3, ultra balls, they're like, design. Can I actually see the ultra balls in this game? Or does it just, no, it doesn't show you what they look like. But, you know they're black with like a little uh, yellow... U, I think it is. It's not a U. It's the bottom of an H. Because in Japan, they're called Hyper Balls. And I was going to say, how cool would it be if Hyper Balls were actually a thing? But they're not. Well, they are. Wait. Yeah, they are in Japan. Okay, I'm just getting stupid. So Mirror B is that way. That's so annoying. I mean, I probably could have predicted that, because this is someone that you have to fight. Everyone down there, you could have avoided if I wanted. I could have just ground that area out. I'm so dumb. That's super frustrating. Oh well, it's only been 15 minutes. We'll just have like a 35 minute episode if we have to. Um, and this, yeah, I just, I'm really, really, really want to fight him. <laughs> it sounds so weird. Okay, we, we can avoid Roller Kid. 
We can avoid that guy up on the right. Maybe we'll come back and battle them later. Because I do want to fight everyone. Because I want to lower my shadow Pokemon and all that. So, let's fight you, little notification guy. <laughs> I need to score points with Mirror B so I can get a promotion. Okay, Hunter Zalo. The classic names are back. What even is a Zalo? No idea. You got a Flaffy and a Dragonair. Flaffy, please. Is Dragonair. W w Dragonite is awesome, but Dragonair is water flying right now, so I don't really want it. If he even has a Shadow Pokemon, he did I don't know. No one else has. Whoa, he does. Yes. Come on. Yeah. Oh, That's way too perfect because I really wanted Ampharos last episode. Also, I'm sorry. My headphone keeps falling out. It's because it's caught around my my cable for my controller. Okay, let's try and catch this thing. Obviously. I haven't actually killed any encounters yet. I'm a little surprised. Let's not start here, because Flaffy is awesome. We had a Flaffy in... Oh, I can't remember. One of our other playthroughs. It's kind of dumb. I've done... What am I doing right now? I want to switch Whelmer out. I'm kind of at the point where I've done however many playthroughs I've done, and I can't remember what's happened in all of them. It's kind of weird, because when I was doing the first playthrough, obviously, like, I remembered pretty much everything that happened, but now, I'm, like, too far through, and I have no idea what happened in the other ones, but there's probably people who can remember, and that seems really strange to me, that there's other people that probably... What is my hair doing? I've got, like, a weird spike. There's probably people somewhere that... that remember more of my content than I, than I do, I think. I don't know. Is that, does that make sense? Because, like, I watch a lot of Shady Penguins content and I remember a lot of things about his older Let's Plays that I just found amusing or funny. And, I don't know, maybe he doesn't remember those and it's weird that I know what happened in his content and he doesn't. Does that make sense? I This is such a weird conversation I'm having right now. That's just Shadow Rush stuff. That also kind of, he was also talking about how YouTube is such like a one-way thing. Like, I'm just sitting here by myself <laughs> talking to the camera, and you guys can respond in the comments section. But like, it's pretty much a one-way thing, and that's kind of, I guess it's not bad, but streaming is so much better for connecting with your audience. And speaking of which, I do want to start streaming. I tried, I did a little test stream, and I want to stream. Mario Sunshine, then Wind Waker, then Metroid Prime, and I'm basically just doing GameCube stuff because I love the GameCube, such a cool console. It's got a little lunchbox handle, how could you not love that? Let's go for another Shadow Rush on Vileplume. Agron is floating again, why does that happen? I can't remember if I noticed that the other time. I noticed it post-production and it's so weird, I don't know why they float. It seems to happen when the red stuff's around. Is Vileplume strong? Wow. I didn't know Vileplume had, like, so much tankiness. Flaffy's quite strong as well. I'm glad that didn't crit. I want to keep Surviper. I've never used a Surviper. It's really cool to have stuff that you haven't used, I guess. Okay, I'm so glad Sunspawn missed. Thank you. Also, its animation is beast. It's so cool. Like, wow. So cool. I love it. <laughs> Vileplume is is now flat. That was like the longest death animation ever. It's got a snow run. I love snow run as well. I'd actually love a shadow snow run, and I probably wouldn't evolve it into Glalie, because I don't really like Glalie all that much. Okay, so Viper's got to come out because we can't heal you up. We also need to catch Flaffy. I've been kind of avoiding that, so I'm going to switch Dunspots in, go for the Yawn or the Glare. Can we even paralyze electric types in this generation? I don't know. I have no idea how this game works. I just kind of throw red and white balls and monsters come out, stuff happens, and then I run away. That's how this game goes for me. Thundershock. Hmm. How does that thing know crunch? Uh-oh. Is this gonna hurt? No, okay. I always get so scared that, like, when I don't know what's going to happen, it's going to be worse. Most of the time it is, but, like... Right. Shadow Rush, I guess. Let's just apps. Actually, let's yawn Flaffy. It's not on Protect. 
Ed, I'm so glad I didn't yawn snow run or attack it. Otherwise, that would have been a complete waste, wouldn't it? Thunder shock again. Okay. Once you've yawned this Flaffy Dunspot, really? Really? Don't don't attack the trainer. I need I really needed you to yawn right then. Oh, that sucks so much. Hmm. Right, now Dunspots has to come out, and Machamp has to come in, I guess, because that's going to be way better at getting stuff. Why can't you just yawn? That's so annoying. You're useless. What even are you? I don't even know what Dunspots is inspired by. Anyway, let's see how much that does. You better kill. Thank you, Snoron's dead. Now we've just got to try and get Flaffy down a bit, which might be a challenge because I don't want to kill it. I was just saying that I've never killed an encounter. Oh, uh, Agron or Machamp critting, I'm pretty sure would kill. Let's just throw an Ultra Ball. <laughs> it seems to have worked before, just throwing Pokeballs at stuff. Um, because seriously, guys, we have caught. We've got the luckiest, the luckiest stuff so far. Let's just go for Shadow Rush, I guess. No, I don't know what to do. Let's switch something back in. Swamp... Oh, yeah, Swamp I can come in. I just had a mini heart attack then. I was like, oh god, I just sent a water type in. But it's okay, because we're immune. Because we got the ground typing, which is nice. Come on, just stay in the Pokeball, Ultra Ball. Two, three... We are so lucky with these encounters! Why didn't I throw an Ultra Ball at the start? That's nuts. How did we just catch that? Ah, oh, no, my bright future. Oh no, Zalo. What are you gonna do? That's just like insane. I don't understand how we caught that. Ah, oh, you ruined all my hopes of getting a promotion. Sob. Right, we've got to run back. It's currently on 22 minutes, roughly, this episode. I think we've got time to get Mirror B. Um, unless we have to fight anyone else. I don't know. I think that's all the Shadow Pokemon in this cave, though. I think there was like two or three, uh, no, three or four that we could have caught and I think that's all of them. The question is, do I want to put Flaffy on the team right now because I, I don't want to get rid of Wilma because it was my starter Pokemon and I love it. But I would prefer Swampert and we can't really have two water types. So it's just like, mm, mm, I don't know what to do. Uh, it's just super annoying because... Like, Wilma, I'm just attached to Wilma, that's the only reason I don't want it. What's this way? Dead end. Dead ends everywhere, I'm hoping. What? Okay. Dead end again. Wes should just jump these. It would be so much easier if we just had a jump function in this game. What are they doing? Game Freak, it wasn't even Game Freak that made this game. Mirror B time, yes. Let's go. You crazy dancing dude. You're not gonna have four Ludicolos, are you? Okay. We're finally here! Yes! I don't even know what to do, he's just dancing like a maniac. Huh. <sighs> yeah, woo! It's about time, my darlings! I'm so frightfully tired of waiting for you! <clears throat> Stop the music! This is gonna be an intense battle. <gasps> oh, you kept me waiting for so long! I decided to work up a little perspiration! <laughs> That's a bit crazy. You, you wanted to sweat. That's weird. Okay. But, my, you have been busy being naughty and messing up our plans. It was oh so close for everything to turn out just right, just the way we hoped. But I can salvage our plan by beating you, little man, and so, there's, uh, there's time for one last frantic dance before the grand finale. Let the music play. Awesome. Versus Mirror B, Cypher Admin. He's just the weirdest character. My hair has now gone really flat, and I'm just like, what is it doing? You got a Clampel and Ariama. I know he has a Shadow Pokemon, and I'm pretty sure he sends it out last. Because during the regular game, he has four Ludicolos, and he sends them out first. Okay, Agron and Wellman, do your thing. Actually, do I want to leave Agron in right now? There's a Fighting type and a Water type. No, Agron, bye bye. You're not staying in. Okay. What can come out? Swamper? Uh, I think Swampert and Machamp is a safe bet. 
Or we could just leave Whelmer in and go for the rollouts, because I don't think Harry Armour or Clampel can really touch Whelmer. So we're going to do that. Um, yeah. I might just might just build up the rollouts, knock out as many Pokemon as I can. Oh, he's going for the fake out. Never mind. Don't go on Wilma, please. Thanks. That was pretty perfect. Right now, I'm going to leave all my Pokemon in hyper mode, I think, because we want to get the crits. Actually, I haven't even seen what level this Pokemon are. I've just been not... 29? You're weak. What? Why are you so weak? I mean, that rollout didn't really touch you, so you're not that weak. But still, a little bit surprised at those low levels. 28 for Clampel. That's a bit strange. Okay, well, I'm gonna try and kill Harry Armour. Because I think it's more of a threat than Clampo. I feel like Clampo is just gonna keep going for Iron Defense. Why is that doing nothing? I know it's not very effective, but like... I just thought Rollout was a better move, honestly. Okay. Swampert is so powerful, I love it. Yes! So, what else do you have then, dude? Are you going to have like another Clample and another Harry Armor, or is it going to be completely randomized? Spinder! What is that dot formation? <laughs> right on your mouth, wow. Okay, let's go for another Shadow Rush on Spinder. I don't know, Welmer's attack missed. You are absolute quality, Welmer. Dizzy Punch, don't confuse me. Don't do it. Thank you. Thank you so much. Oh my god, Swamp. <laughs> I'm so glad we got this on the team. This is an absolute tank. It's like Agron. You just kind of press Shadow Rush. And it gets crits and things die. And it's just the best. He's got a Vibrava. 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 So the reason I was wondering if he'd have another Clan Pearl and Harry Armor was because... I don't know if the randomizer randomizes every single encounter of a Pokemon, or if it or if it switches like Ludicolo with. I was gonna say Chespin then. Don't know why Chespin came into my head. Um, let's go for Shadow Rush on Clampo and a Water Pulse on Vibrava. Vibrava. I don't know how you say that one. Um, so I didn't know if it like swapped the Pokemon around or if it was that not super effective. I guess it wasn't. I thought you were ground flying. I guess flying was this water now. Learn something new every day. Clampel has used a lot of iron defenses, I think. Or did I not crit that time? Hmm. We're getting a bit lucky, actually. I feel like he's missing a lot of his attacks. Okay, so this is going pretty well so far. Although Swampert is on kind of low health. I'm really not sure what's up with those shadows. <laughs> Swampert and Wes are currently flying. Okay. So I don't know if I should cool Swampert and then heat him up or if I should just switch out because like right now we're actually pretty safe. We're, we're free to just kill this Vibrava. I think it's Vibrava. Uh, Clampel is not a threat to Swampert so we can heal up next turn I hope and then keep Swampert healthy. My voice is dying right now. I'm so sorry. We've only got like a few minutes left. I guess it's going to be a longer episode. Which kind of makes up, the last episode was a little bit shorter, it was like 25 minutes. I'm so inconsistent, but it's whatever. We're actually keeping up the daily uploads, which is so good. I'll probably record another episode after this as well, so I'm a bit ahead. Oh boy, coughing! What a good encounter! We just caught a poison type. No, I don't want co I don't really don't want coughing. I very much dislike that Pokemon. Like... I don't know why, I just really don't like his design. Sorry if you like coughing. That's only going to be on the team if we've only got six Pokemon or less left. Ah, <sighs> Just don't explode on me and we'll be all good. And what I'm going to do is throw an Ultra Ball right out the gate because it'll probably catch it based on <laughs> the luck we've been having lately. And then will be good to go. Also, I've seen a few comments saying, is the Shadow Pokemon always on the left or always on the top of the HP bar? This time it isn't, but normally I think it has been. It's only because he sent it out last, and I think the trainers always send out their Shadow Pokemon first or last, so I don't know. Probably could have got away with a Super Potion there. Oh well. Just waste my money. 
I need to go buy some stuff actually and probably sell those like proteins and car boss things that we got. Because uh, I probably won't use them. Did you see that there? You could kind of see the hate. What do you mean it broke free of the ball? That sucks. That's not meant to happen. Oh my god, the animation's kind of cool though. I'll give it that. That shadow rush. Okay. Level 35. Why coughing? Like, we could have had a good Pokemon that was level 35. If Registill had been level 35, that would have been pretty cool. Swampert is hurt by the Whirlpool. I mean, I'm pretty sure Swampert would just swim out of it. Whoa, we've got an extra move! Takedown, when when did that happen? Let's Shadow Rush Clamp Pearl. Let's heal up Wilma with a Super Potion. We need to buy more Super Potions as well. We're running out of health. That's not good. Okay. After this turn, we should be good for coughing. Nope, never mind. Clamp Pearl's living again! Oh dear, Coughing's gonna go for another Shadow Rush and do absolutely nothing that time. It did a lot more damage to Welma. It's a little bit worrying. Maybe Welma's not as good as I think it is. Maybe it's gotta switch out. I think once we get to Agate Village and can start purifying stuff, then then it will be worth switching Welma off. Cause I like it because it's the only pure Pokemon. But it's our starter as well. I can't get rid of our starter. That's so mean. Let's go for a... I feel like a Astonish won't do anything. Just test the waters, see how much this does. Don't kill. Okay, you did nothing, that's good. We'll just use that a few times and keep spamming Ultra Balls with Swampert and we'll get it eventually. Gets Clam Pearl's dead now. Awesome. It's just whatever. Clam Pearl fainted. Wilma leveled up. Please evolve. Please, that would be so good if you evolve. Coughing flinched. Yo, that's good as well. I'd love... I'd just love a purified... Whoa. We've got a Shadow Waylord, but I'd love a purified one right now. That would be awesome. Okay. Let's go for another Astonish. I just really hope this catches. All I need now to make this episode perfect is for this thing to stay in the Pokeball. Watch the, watch the yellow. It looks like an H. Look. I really want you guys to see this. I don't know why. Did you see? It was like there for like two frames. Really? We can catch a Registeel on over half health, we can't catch a Coughing. Why? That's dumb. Okay. Mm, I'm like running out of commentary right now. Can you tell? You finished again though, that's good. Basically, when it hits like the half an hour mark, I'm like, okay. Kinda done talking now. Wanna go do something else? Hey, wait, what did I just do? Okay. <laughs> what do you mean you got through two Pokeballs in one turn? That would be pretty good though, right? Yeah. Just like you don't catch your first turn, you just catch it a second turn. That that makes sense. That would be a good good thing to do. Okay, one, two, three. No, why? Mirror B in the background, just chilling. <sighs> I just really want to see if Whelmer evolves as well. I actually don't know what the evolution animation looks like in this game, so that's going to be cool. Coffin keeps flinching. There's no way Astonish has a 100% flinch rate. Is it? There's no way. That would be so broken. But we're just getting super lucky, surely. Come on. Please, this time. Please. Probably turns out I could have just gone for a water pulse and it wouldn't have killed and it would have been fine and caught it like first time. Three. Yes! Gotcha coughing was caught. Thank you, Mirror B. Thank you so much. Defeated you. I don't actually know what happens now, so that's gonna be fun. I guess we'll find out next episode. <gasps> oh, I can't keep up with the tempo. Oh, what was that animation? He gave us like bare cash though, that's good. We definitely need money. Huh, how? How dare you? Don't you dare think you'll get away with your latest outrage. <sighs> One of these days I will take great pleasure in kicking you about with my elegant dance steps. Oh, and I'm not giving up our Shadow Pokemon plan. Let's go, escape! Dun dun dun. <laughs> that run, oh my god, I love that run so much. <laughs> so perfect. Ugh. Okay, I'm not gonna do that. There's Puzzle. Sam, did you hear those cries? It must be Puzzle. I think those cries came from behind that door. 
Oh, we got an item. Is that a TM? I think it's probably a TM. Da -da -da -da. TM49. I knew it. Okay. There's an iron file and an item. Da -da -da. I'm actually not going to read that right now because I think it's about purification based on the fact that it's, it says P. We got a macho brace, which is probably helpful. And then there's plus all just in the spotlight right here. I'm going to do this bit really quickly. Uh, Sam, plus all. How did they get here? Like, what? <laughs> gosh, gosh, Sam, you're safe. Oh, and Plusle. <gasps> kin kin. This is a bit of a weird cry. Awesome. Mira B got away, but things will be back to normal here. Uh, Duking, I don't know what to say. Forget it, Silver. We're all unharmed. That's good enough. I'm just dead with the voices as well. I'm so sorry. <gasps> Even that Mira B has been driven out thanks to Sam. Yay. Hmm, what's that, Plusle? Feeling hungry out of relief? <laughs> Okay, Sam, let's quit this moldy cavern and quick. And quick. Hmm, Sam, we owe you a great deal. Sincerely, thank you. If you're even a bit later, Plusle could have been made a shadow Pokemon. That's horrible. I'm glad everything's fine, Papa, and Plusle too. Oh my god, Plusle's mad stunts. <laughs> hmm, what's the massive Plusle? Oh, you want to. Okay, I understand. Sam, could you take my Plusle with you? Plusle is saying he wants to help you too. He just gives away his beloved Pokemon that we just rescued? Yes, yes, that's right. You can't let those criminals get away with it. That's amazing. We've got a cute and brave addition to our party. Have we? I think it's not going to be a puzzle somehow. Ah, oh, Sam, I'm counting on you. Do we not even have to, like, does it just go to the box? Yes. I'm going to go check that out. Um, actually, I'll do it next episode. It's been a long one. Oh, I intend to investigate the organization behind Mirror B. As soon as I discover anything, I'll be in touch. Which reminds me, Sam, I need your PDA number. Oh, that's a Pokemon Digital Assistant, or PDA for short. Why does it have a star in the middle? It's so weird. <laughs> Sam, where's yours? You have to tell Duking your number so he can contact us. Da -da -da -da. Perfect. I will be in touch as soon as we discover anything. Sweet, we got Duking's PDA number. I'm actually going to check the plus all next episode. Gonna spin around loads. Um, sorry, it's been a super long episode. I just really wanted to get Mirror B so bad. We had a bit of an annoying detour, but it's whatever. We've done it now. We've got a couple of encounters. I need to check one of them. That's gonna be exciting, but I'll do it next episode. If you guys enjoyed today's episode, please leave a like down below. Let me know what you thought of the Nintendo Direct as well. I'm super interested. And that is everything I've got for you today. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you next time.